I'm now talking to Victor Muller, who's Chief Executive Officer of Spiker Cars. He leads the group that has agreed terms to purchase Saab Automobile from GM. Victor Muller, as the new owner of Saab, you've been working against the clock, possibly even through the night, trying to secure this deal. Many experts said it was quite impossible. How did you finally manage to achieve it in such a short space of time? How was the deal done? Uh, I think the deal was done by tenacity, by just simply not giving up. Uh, we've had tremendous adverse circumstances along the way, uh, but um, the objective to save Saab was generally overriding, and uh, we just didn't want to lose that opportunity and see such a beautiful company, such an iconic brand, with such great people um, lose their jobs, brand go down. It would have been a tremendous loss. Well, obviously, the negotiations have been between you at Spike Cars and General Motors, but how involved have the Saab team and management been involved? Well, they were very involved. I mean, uh, one has to bear in mind that this was also a, a, a carve-out of a company that had been under um, uh, GM's ownership for the past 20 years. So there were a tremendous lot of uh, connections between the two which had to be cut. And uh, so without the management of Saab, we would have absolutely not been able to do that. What attracts you to Saab? What was your first interest? Well, it's maybe a very uh, standard answer, but I, uh, I remember them very well when I was a kid and I, I drove Saabs. Uh, I have always been attracted to their quirkiness, their um, very unusual design, their beautiful, beautiful shapes, and, uh, and I think